At the same time, a wide range of modifications of the first generation Opel Astra F was presented, consisting of three and five door hatchbacks, a convertible, a four door sedan, a five door caravan station wagon, and its commercial three door version for transporting goods without rear glazing. Parts. At the same time, sports modifications also debuted GT, equipped with a 2.0 liter engine, 115 horsepower, and the most powerful 16 valve GSI. 2.0 liter, 150 horsepower. By the way, fans of charged cars will be very interested to know that the GSI version was produced not only in the traditional modification, three-door hatchback, but also as a five-door caravan station wagon. The Astra F is much better protected from corrosion than the Cadet, although early years of production can still show rust on the sills, wheel arches, and the corners of the fenders and doors. Attractive upholstery materials were used for interior trim, the seats are quite comfortable and have good lateral support. The dashboard is very elegant, and the center console is slightly turned towards the driver for greater convenience. Inside, four people will fit quite normally, but three people in the gallery will be cramped. In addition, the height of the back of the rear sofa can also be criticized, even for people who are 1.70 meters tall, the shoulder blades are just at the level of its upper edge. But even tall passengers will comfortably sit in the front seats. There is a remark about visibility for the three-door hatchback. During lateral maneuvers, the wide middle pillar slightly worsens visibility. All modifications are characterized by an imperfect fuel gauge, which often distorts the actual amount of gasoline in the tank, and also often fail due to poor quality connection of plug connectors, power windows, and central locking. Adherents of multifunctional golf class cars will undoubtedly be interested in the fact that the dimensions of the Opel Astra luggage compartment are one of the largest among classmates. For example, the trunk volume for hatchbacks is 340-1200 liters, or VW Golf 3, 330-1162, or Renault 19, 386-1310. The J Astra Caravan has 500-1630 and the Golf I variant has 465-1425. Engine. Astra was equipped with a wide range of four-cylinder engines, 10 gasoline and units were intended for it, starting from the weakest 1.4 liter and ending with the charged 16-valve 2.0 liter engine, as well as two diesel engines, native Oplevsky, with a volume of 1.7 liters and a Japanese turbo diesel ICZ 1.7 liters. On average, the motor resource and is 250 to 302 km. The gas distribution mechanism of all units is driven by a toothed belt, which is recommended to be changed every 6,000 kilometers along with the tension roller. The pump does not serve for a long time, on average 60 to 80,000 kilometers, so it is advisable to replace it along with the timing belt that uses it. When buying gasoline versions, it is better to give preference to 8 valve units, since the 1.4 liter, 90 horsepower, and V6 liter, 100 horsepower. 16 valve units equipped with the Ecotec engine management system are not high enough at low speeds. But the Ecotec engines with a volume of 1.8 liters, 116 horsepower, and 2.0 liters, 136 horsepower, are free from this drawback. Since this system was upgraded in 1995, an 8 valve oil often leaks from under the leaky sealing ring of the ignition distributor. Those wishing to purchase a diesel modification are better off opting for the ICZ 1.7 liter turbo diesel, 82 horsepower, since the 1.7 liter diesel, 60 horsepower, is not powerful enough, especially for the 1,135 kilogram caravan station wagon. At the same time, the Japanese has one feature that somewhat increases the cost of its maintenance. Over time, it is necessary to adjust the thermal clearances of the valves and the engine using special washers. Transmission. Most of the cars were equipped with a 5-speed manual gearbox, Astra with a 4-speed automatic is much less common. The weak point of mechanical gearboxes is that over time, the gear rod pin fails, which makes it difficult to turn on, and the backstage oil seal and axle shaft oil seals can also leak. Although the manufacturer does not recommend changing the oil in the mechanics, but only topping up if necessary. The specialists of the branded service station advise changing the oil in every 100,000 kilometers to ensure the long-term operation of the gearbox. The clutch cable drive is reliable and, as a rule, does not create problems during operation. On average, the disc, clutch basket, and release bearing nurse 150 to 200,000 kilometers. As for the automatic machines, 
they should change the oil along with the filter every 60,000 kilometers during normal operation and after 40,000 kilometers with intensive operation. Suspension. Suspension moderately soft and energy intensive. Weaknesses are the stabilizer struts, which can come off when they fall into a large hole, and the vertical silent block of the front arm, on average, it serves 60,000 kilometers. Ball bearings and silent blocks of the rear beam are durable, about 150,000 kilometers can go. Steering. Rack and pinion steering has good information content. Cars manufactured after 1994 were equipped with hydraulic booster. It is worth noting that this Astra assembly is not very reliable since the steering rack oil seals and the booster pump can often leak in it. Over time, the steering gear bushing also brakes. Brake system. The braking system is very effective, besides the cars of the last years of production were equipped with ABS as standard. For the most part, Astras have front disc brakes and rear drum brakes, and sports modifications have front and rear disc brakes. In the drums, cuffs of the working cylinders often leak. Despite the shortcomings, the Opel Astra, F, has important positive qualities, the low cost of both the machine itself and its spare parts and maintenance, as well as the presence of a wide selection of modifications and power units.